hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be showing you how i make my apple cinnamon french toast so stay tuned after the intro and see how it's done Okay, so the ingredients and the measurements will definitely be in the description below. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Right here, I just made sure my pan was nicely heated before I add my butter. And then after my butter is nicely melted, I'm going to add my brown sugar and get that caramelized before I add in my apples. I seasoned my apples with some cinnamon and some nutmeg. Once my sugar is completely mounted and caramelized, I'm going to add my apples and I'm just going to let those sit for about three to four minutes, depending on the heat that you have your stove on. But I'm just going to let mine sit for about three to four minutes covered and that's about it. So here I'm going to be using the oat nut bread and I have some cinnamon, some nutmeg, about one egg, I scrambled it already, I'm going to be using some vanilla and I have evaporated milk. You can use whole milk if you want, I'm using evaporated milk because it goes better with my stomach, <laughs> okay? So I'm just going to mix all those ingredients inside of this pan and then place my breads in the pan to soak them up just a little bit and then flip them and do the same to the next side before I toss them in the pan to cook. So once you have the desired amount that you'll be making finish, go ahead and oil your pan with some butter. Make sure your pan is already nicely and heated first before you add your butter in. And then you're gonna go ahead and drop in your French toast. And you're gonna let it sit on one side for about three to four minutes depending on how you like your French toast. And then you're gonna flip it over to the next side and make sure you do the same to the next side. And you're just gonna repeat those same steps throughout until all of your French toasts are done. And there you have it people, your apple cinnamon french toast with maple syrup drizzled on top. Thank you for tuning into this video. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Also hit that notification bell so you'll never miss any tips or videos to come. God bless you all and I will see you next time.